Hello and welcome back to part 17 of this series. This is going to be the last video where we deploy our finished blog website. To deploy our website, we're going to use this service called Netlify, which is really cool. You just um, sign up and you just link your GitHub or Bitbucket or GitLab account and you just deploy um, your website from the GitHub repository. So let's, let's do that. So before we do that, I'm going to create a new repository and uh, I hope you're doing the same. Well, you should be because it's amazing. <laughs> I'm going to create a repository and I'm going to call it Gatsby, Gatsby blog tutorial. I'm going to name it like this because I'm going to post this repository for you guys as well to have access to the code that we wrote. In case you experienced a problem or anything, you can just get it from there. Create repository and I'm going to grab this link. Let's, why well, want that copy? Okay, let's head back to our project. Let's maximize this, stop the development server. Let's commit our changes. Git add, git commit. Uh, created authors page, um, created team and authors page, page, finished application. Now we need to add uh, the repository we created as a remote repository to this. So get remote, uh, add origin, and we paste that link, I mean, the, whatever this thing is. <laughs> and let's push, so git push. Oh, this is the first push, so I need to set upstream, so git push, and shorthand for set upstream is dash u, origin master, master. And we are up and running on GitHub uh, in a moment. <laughs> Any moment now, and there we go. So we are on, up on GitHub. If we refresh, we see our code here. Brilliant. Okay, let's go to Netlify. I'm gonna log in. I've already got like two projects here. Let's do new site and select GitHub. And it's gonna prompt you to connect your uh, account, uh, your GitHub account to your Netlify account. I've already done that. And I'm going to pick this, which is a Gatsby blog tutorial, which we just created. And Netlify is so much better now. By default, it's got the, your command, which is uh, Gatsby build, which is what you do eventually to build out your static files and the, the direct, the public directory, directory slash public. So we don't need to change anything here. We just click deploy and yeah, so now it's deploying our application. It's going to take a, a few minutes, uh, roughly around three minutes, I think. And once it's done, our application will be live, guys. And you can as well uh, attach it to a custom domain that you've registered. If you have a registered domain, you can attach that domain and you can uh, um, do SSL encryption to... Uh, for your website, which is really good for search engine optimization, uh, bumps up your ranking in uh, search engines, though, uh, having uh, HTTPS enabled and enforced in your site. Um, yeah, let's give it a moment. Uh, I'll come back when, once this is done. Okay, so our application has been uh, deployed. If we click on this link that's been given here to us, and there we go, we see our application deployed live. Actually, it's already got HTTPS. We just need to attach our domain to it. I'm not gonna do that, but you can do that if you want when you create, uh, when you deploy your app. Everything works as we have coded it to work. The plugin works, the social media buttons, the tags, the about page, which just has some <laughs> lorem ipsum uh, text there, the tags pages, everything works guys. Like, like, like the local one, there's no difference. So the beauty of this as well is that it's linked to your Git, GitHub repository or GitLab or Bitbucket, so it's linked to your repository. So if we go to if we go to our application, 
um, to our, I mean, code base. And since the, all these folders are tracked, we can add an image here and we can add a new post. So we can add a new post. Let's do that. So I'm going to create a new file and actually the name of the, of the files don't matter. So fourth post and let's copy everything from here and let's give this an extension of .md and let's paste this, let's call this fourth post and this is post on, posted on the 4th of uh, uh, November, uh, December by Jane and this has only, I don't know, tutorial and new post on Netlify, I don't know Let's just give it that, the same image, and if we save, and if we add these changes, let's uh, do get add, and get commit, create added new post, and in the same line as well, I'm gonna push, so and get push. Now, it should, push to the github repository and as well deploy from Netlify so let's check if that's happened um, I don't know if it takes some time okay, if we refresh well it should post let me check let's refresh just in case okay it's not posting or is it? Maybe it takes some time. Let's wait for it. Did we push? Um, commits. Added new post. Yeah, there we go. We have our fourth post. It just took some time to uh, to update. So yeah, it actually. Uh, you, you, when you push, it actually automatically detects that and runs again. Got to be built to uh, to build the new the new the the new static file uh, for the new post. So there we go. So we have our completed application. We deployed it live. So that's everything from start to finish for Gatsby. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this series. I've definitely enjoyed uh, making it, and um, I hope you stick around. Uh, in my channel and uh, we're gonna I don't know I'm gonna make some more videos obviously soon about uh, other other stuff so uh, <laughs> so tune in for that and uh, like and subscribe and all that good stuff you know what to do thank you for watching and I'll see you soon bye